Kayla's family and investigators wondering whether better cell service could have saved Kaylin's life. The car she was in had to drive several miles to Salem before her friends could call for help. News to ABC Capital correspondent Amal Talishi taking a look at what state lawmakers might be able to do to address the problem. For years, lawmakers have been pushing for better coverage in rural areas. The recent tragedy shining more light on that issue. When I heard this, I, I couldn't even come up with words to express how tragic and horrific this is. Assemblymember Matthew Simpson's district occupies Washington County, where Gillis was killed. He says the lack of cell phone service is a public safety issue that the legislature will address. I actually have a meeting next week with one of the providers, and this is going to be the topic of how we can continue to, you know, build out this program and what we need to do as lawmakers. We've had these discussions, but, you know, as I said, it's, it's been treated differently than uh, broadband has. Simpson says this could mean incentivizing the build out of cell towers. Assemblywoman Aileen Gunther, who is a member of the Upstate Cellular Coverage Task Force, says her district of Sullivan and Orange County has many regions where there's little to no coverage. It's especially concerning considering the outdoor activities like canoeing, tubing and hiking that take place there. That um, puts a lot of people in danger. You know, we have had, you know, different incidents in that area and uh, people are unable to get the help that they needed because there is not cell phone coverage. When I asked Gunther why companies don't provide service in those areas. Because they want clusters. They want to make money. And, you know, if, uh, you know, some areas have few and far between, but that doesn't mean that they shouldn't provide the services. They're making money hand over fist. Gunther says right now it's unknown when the task force will meet next. Reporting in Albany, Amel Talaji.